Okay, we're recording. Hello, my name is Donette Douglas. I am the station manager here at WTJR Channel 16 in Quincy, Illinois. We are an affiliate of the Christian Television Network based out of Tampa, Florida. And this program behind the scenes is recorded right here in the studio at 222 North 6th Street. We're located on the second floor. And as always, we have a lot of behind the scene news to share with you. Amen. Amen. I want to first uh, mentioned that this week we did uh, have the volunteers here and they helped fold and put label on the March newsletter and we got that in the mail yesterday and uh, when you get it uh, on the the uh, front I have got ways to watch WTJR and we will go through that during the program at various times I will tell you some of the information and of course we always have behind the scenes events and on the back side we have the schedule for 16.1 that's the national local programming here at WTJR and any of the gray areas that you see here uh, those are program changes and we had some changes uh, for the month of March and uh, if you would like to get on our newsletter um, uh, list mailing list or even on an email. We could email it to you. Just contact us here at the station. We'll have information during the program, and we will get that newsletter out to you. Well, let's get to the pictures from the last two we uh, last week, I should say. <clears throat> now, this screen here is the screen that appears when we tape a program. This is for the master control room. They know the, the number of the program. Well, this last week on A Woman's Joy, we taped program 767. We taped on February 22nd, 2022. The run right there, that's the complete uh, time of the program with the front and the close on it. The PT stands for production time. That's what I said on the clock. And uh, so the uh, host of the program will know how long they have to speak. So I won a woman's joy last week. We taped two programs with our dear sister, Sherry McDaniel. And she's with the Sisters Fellowship Group. And she uh, ministers, helps minister there at the First Baptist Church in Canton, Missouri. She also has a Facebook page, a uh, blog for the sisters. You might want to check that out sometime. And then the next program is The Simple Truth. And again, this is what the master control operator will see at the beginning of every new program. We tape program number 329 with the host, John Furness. And he taped two programs, and he just changed his clothes so then you don't think it's the same day <laughs> or the same message. And uh, anyway, he taped two wonderful uh, programs, one on conversion and one about Peter's sermon from Acts chapter 2. And those will be coming up in a few weeks. This is Pray 16, and this last Friday, due to all the snow and the ice storms, and being able to get into the building and etc., cetera, uh, we uh, were not able to go live with Pray 16. So we had this program we had taped for the first of the year, or I, I really should say we played it the last Friday of December that Gary and Paula Wallace recorded. And it's kind of uh, uh, just giving you words of encouragement for the new year and uh, talking about prayer and how important it is in our walk. So uh, we re-aired that, and that's why, because of the weather. And then this is a picture of our volunteers that were able to get here yesterday. 
to help with the newsletter. We had a wonderful time of fellowship. We laugh together and share uh, testimonies and we pray together and then we have a little bit of lunch before they leave. So it's just a great time with a wonderful, wonderful group of volunteers. Some of them have been here longer than me and I've been here 20 plus years. So I just really appreciate them very much. And this is uh, Penny and Eileen. Penny is standing. Uh, she doesn't. She usually takes the picture, so she won't have to be in the picture. But I uh, surprised her, <laughs> and I picked up the camera and got her picture. So they are uh, finished counting uh, the newsletters before they took them to the post office. Amen. And this picture right here, uh, yes, the studio, you can see we've got tables and chairs set up because we're getting ready for the Elijah, Elisha impartation weekend. And we've got the tables and chairs out. We're kind of running the cameras or working them around uh, because uh, after this program, we've only had one more program before the conference. And uh, so we're getting prepared as we have time, you know, you have to do that. And we're excited about the impartation conference. And next week, I'll give you the update about that, okay, on behind the scenes. God bless. Okay, let's see what we got. Oh, we got an update. We did get another donation. We're at $9,958. Yes, almost to hit that $10,000. That's wonderful. And uh, we thank God for each and every donation. May God richly bless you because you have planted that seed in good soil because we are proclaiming the gospel of Jesus Christ right here from WTJR 24 hours, seven days a week. And we proclaim it to the nations all over the world. And I'm thankful for that. Amen. WTGR channel 16. And this is on the, uh, if you get the newsletter, ways to watch WTJR. Well, we have channel 16.1, which is HD, which is high definition. That's our national local programming. We have channel 16.2, which is CTN lifestyle. We have 16.3 CTNI, which is Spanish Christian programming. And then we also air Christian video channel. Now, the Christian video channel will air late at night, early in the morning, Monday through Friday, up to about 7 in the morning. And then on the weekend, it's Christian video channel. And that is music videos, movies, children programming, and WTJR classics. Channel 16.4 or is CTN out of Clearwater, Florida. And 16.5, our newest channel, is Radio 16. This is worship music. And I'm getting many, many good comments and feedback from this, how people just love to put that music on and work in their home or read or whatever. And uh, they have that music in the background. It's just so peaceful and relaxing to have that worship going in your home. I, I myself play that a lot. WTGR is your locally supported Christian television station. And your deduction, your, deno I should say, donations are tax deductible, for we are a nonprofit. And we are so thankful that many, many, many people and churches are faithful to support the work here at WTJR. We're working together here till Jesus returns, right? And it takes all of us. If you would like to join us in prayer, we have prayer here in the studio on Mondays from 1 to 2 p.m. Located on 2nd floor, 222 North 6th Street here at Quincy. And just come and join together with us in agreement because we believe that God hears our prayers and answers them. Amen. If you need prayer anytime, call 217-228-1616. If you happen to get the answering machine, please leave your name and phone number that you'd like prayer, and we will get back with you. Or you can watch You and Me, that's the American's prayer meeting, and that's on <clears throat> coming from Clearwater, Florida. And we hear it on Monday through Friday on channel 16.1 and 16.4 at 1130 p.m. It's a three-hour program of prayer. This 800 number, write it down because you can call that anytime for prayer, 1-800-716-7729.
soul winning training. If you're interested in that, give me a call. I'll be glad to encourage you and pray with you. And we use the script from uh, the soul winning script, I should say, from the Great Awakening. And our theme scripture is Mark 16, 15. Go ye into all the world and preach the gospel to every creature. I wanted to let you know that uh, Robert Bob DeAndreas Memorial Service, we uh, CTN has cut it down to one hour, and we are going to be playing that uh, so the viewers can also see his memorial service. And that will air on Monday, February 28th at 2 a.m., Sunday, March the 6th at 9 p.m., Sunday, March 13th at 11 a.m., and on Saturday, March 26th at 8 p.m. And if you would like to make a donation uh, to his memorial fund, you can send that donation or even a card. His wife, Jane, uh, his daughter, Yolanda, and his son, Bodie. You could send cards to Christian Television Network, Post Office Box 6922, Clearwater, Florida, 33758. <clears throat> you can also download the CTN app. That's another good way to watch WTJR. You can uh, load it on your uh, iPhone, Android, or on your tablet. Or if you have Roku or Apple TV on your television, you can also download the CTN app. You can watch all of the uh, 23 affiliate stations, and you can take WTJR with you everywhere you go. Isn't that wonderful? Amen. <clears throat> Excuse me, I got a little bit of a frog there. Friend us on our Facebook page, WTJR TV. We have a couple of live programs on there, the Pray 16 on Fridays at 11 a.m., Revive America on the first Tuesday of the month, at 7 p.m. we have worship, and 7.30 p.m. is a message by Evangelist Robert Newton. We have behind-the-scenes events. We have community calendar events. Sometimes I put some scriptures on. Jim will add some videos and spots he's working on here at the station. We have a variety of things that we put on there. And we would like you to friend us on our Facebook page, WTJR TV. Coming up on A Woman's Joy this next week, my guest is Sherry McDaniel. And uh, she and I started a new series on the power of the blood covenant. And you want to be sure and watch that on Tuesday at 9.30 a.m. and Friday at 9 p.m. Behind the scenes, the program you're watching right now, airs on Friday at 6 p.m., Sunday at 7.30 p.m., and on Monday at 1 p.m. And that's picture the uh, production room in there. You see the back of Jim's head and all those monitors. Amen. Christ Video is a half-hour music video program that we air here at WTJR. It was produced by Jim Wilson, our engineer. And you can watch that on Tuesday at 3 p.m., Friday at 10 p.m., and Saturday at 11.30 p.m. Conquering your giants with our with the host Dick, not Dick. I do we do have a Dick. I've got several uh, different host names here, and I'm getting them confused. Duke Duvall hosts Conquering Your Giants, and the message is Grace, God's Grace at Christ's Expense, Part Three. And if you've missed any of the previous programs, and this goes for any of the local programs that we tape here. You can go on our WTJR YouTube page. That's another way you can watch WTJR. Conquering Your Giants is on Wednesday evenings at 9.30 p.m. and Sunday morning at 6.30 a.m. Emotional Health with Dr. Vani. She has started a new series on overcoming anxiety. That's on Thursday at 9.45 a.m., and Sunday at 3.45 p.m. Exploring God's Word with Pastor Robert Axton. And he shared with me that he had, was contacted by somebody in California 
that is watching his program and being blessed by it. Isn't that exciting? That's what I love about WTJR. We are reaching the nations, all of the United States, all of the countries. God is making it available for people to hear the gospel of Jesus Christ. Pastor Axton is on a series. This will be part one of the origin of languages or the beginning of nations. You can watch that on Monday at 930 a.m. and Saturday at 3 p.m. I believe one of our new shows hosted by Dick Stewart, and he's teaching about being born again, part three. You can watch this on Thursday at 9.30 a.m. and Sunday at 3.30 p.m. Musical Memories with Martha Reed Garvin, one of the favorites here at WTJR. You can watch that on Saturday at 6.30 p.m. and Sunday at 8 p.m. And you can sing along with those old church hymns. I love those church hymns, and I know many of you do, too. Outreach Connection is hosted by Sandy Axton, and her guests are John and Shirley Helmut. And they are missionaries, and they live in Kelowna, Iowa. And you can watch this program in Monday at 11 a.m., Wednesday at 9 p.m., and Saturday at 5 p.m. Pastor Speak Special. Pastors Gary and Paula Wallace at River of Life Church here in Quincy. This is part two of the message, The Urgency of the Hour. You can watch that on Sunday at 2 p.m., Tuesday at 1.30 p.m. and Wednesday at 7.30 p.m. Pray 16, that's our live call-in prayer show. And it's the first Friday of the month coming up. And Pastor Tim Redd of the Second Baptist Church in uh, Fort Madison, Iowa, is always the co-host along with Gary Wallace. We do repeat the program on Saturdays at 8 p.m. and Monday at 9 p.m. You can also watch it live on our Facebook page, WTJR TV. Besides calling in on our phone number, 217-228-1616, you can email your prayer request, your praise reports to pray16 at WTJR.org. Revive America live here at WTGR at 7 p.m. on Tuesday, March the 1st. You can join us here in the studio if you would want to. Please be here by 645. We'd be glad to pray for you. And you can also call in for prayer. Uh, Evangelist Robert Newton will bring a message at 730 p.m. And an area worship team will be bringing worship at 7 p.m. So mark that on your calendar. Revive America live on Tuesday, March 1st. Ten Commandments series with Jim Daniels. Uh, This next week, he's talking about the second commandment, thou shall not make idols. That will air on Wednesday at 9.30 a.m., Thursday at 9 p.m., and Saturday at 7.30 p.m. The Secret Place Ministries with Minister Darlene Holiday. This next week, the message is about your past does not define you. And you can watch this on Monday at 9.45 a.m. and Saturday at 3.15 p.m. And The Simple Truth with Bible teacher, Pastor John Furness. He is uh, on a series about repentance, and this is part two. If you missed any of the programs, like I said earlier, our local programs, you can go to our YouTube page and watch them. The Simple Truth is on Mondays at 7.30 p.m. and Sunday at 2.30 p.m. Hometown Happenings. And uh, we do have a special uh, event we want to tell you about. Again, there's information how to contact us there on the screen. This is a a map of our DMA area. Now, DMA stands for Domestic Market Area. And it's in yellow there. And it's usually 60 to 70 miles out around Quincy. And in that area... 
is you can watch WTJR over the air. You can watch us on your local cable company. And you can watch us on Dish Channel 32. I do want to give you a um, heads up that WTJR is not on DirecTV. WTJR is not on DirecTV, okay? They may say they have all the local programming, but they do not have carry WTJR. Also, um, on our Facebook, WTJR TV, you can web stream and watch all four of the channels. Um, yeah, not on our Facebook, I should say, web stream on the computer. <laughs> I got that a little bit confused. I was a reading ahead there, wasn't I? Uh, the uh, event that I wanted to highlight this week is the Wind, the Fire, and the Rain Revival. Friday, March 4th, and Saturday, March the 5th at 6.30 p.m., and Sunday, March 6th at 10.30 a.m. at the Hannibal First Assembly of God Church, 1901 Missouri Avenue in Hannibal, Missouri. The special speaker will be Evangelist Barry Young from Kansas City, Missouri. So you might want to walk, mark that down on your calendar and attend some of those services or all of them. Amen. Amen. So if you have a church or outreach ministry event coming up, please send the information to us two weeks ahead of time. We'll get it on Hometown Happenings, on WTGR Community Calendar, on our Facebook page. You can also email us, tv16 at wtgr.org, to send us that information. And there we are back in the studio, getting ready for the Elijah, 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 Elisha, there we go, impartation weekend. I'm so excited about it, and uh, we're thankful that we have that opportunity. We have many pastors coming in, and we get to uh, worship with them and, and bless them, and, and uh, hopefully they go home with a new zeal, yeah, to serve the Lord. Amen. Okay, we have a little video of Bob uh, D'Andrea's memorial service that I want to show you right now. And uh, then we will be back with some more here on Behind the Scenes. powerful. You may be seated. Won't you welcome Brian Morris, the son-in-law is going to come. These are words from the family. Give him a great God bless you as he comes today. So I want to thank uh, everyone for being here on behalf of the family. And, um, you know, I thought it was a little ironic that the family would have the funny, goofy talker of the family represent the quietest member of our family, Bob DeAndre. <laughs> and uh, I was thinking about, and anyone that knows, uh, you know, knew my father-in-law, what he got when he got to heaven. Um, obviously, he got a glorified body, so he got speed, right? <laughs> if anybody knows how fast he would walk, uh, and Jane would know that too in the years of his life where it was like, come on, Dad. He'd be like, I'm coming. That's what he'd say. And, uh, you know, he got perfect pitch because we all know he couldn't sing. I love that guy. He got to heaven, and I bet he just shocked himself. He started singing and with the cherubim and seraphim, and it's like, whoa, I can sing now. It was, I mean, come on, Jesus. And uh, I just, I love the fact that that of who dad was to each person he met, right? And I actually Googled, this is a true story. I Googled Bob DeAndre just to see what would come up. And I told Yolanda this the other day. It says, 
one of the, the second thing, first or second thing, you know, so that was hitting on Google at that time said, Bob DeAndre named to Guinness Book of World Records as world's oldest doo-wop lead singer. <laughs> I'm, I'm not joking. <laughs> but I want to share a little bit today, just real quick, uh, from the family and who we knew him as. And I wanted to start with Jane. And uh, I've said this publicly in front of many people, and obviously you here, you know, there's no one else that we would want, have dad have wanted to marry than Jane. And Jane, we love you deeply, deeply. And I teased Jane so bad for having a southern accent. Hey, come on in here, everybody. Breakfast is just about ready. Want to play some ping pong? I love Jane. So this is what Jane shared. Revelations 22, 1 through 2. And he showed me a pure river of water of life, crystal as clear, or sorry, clear as crystal, proceeding from the throne of God and of the Lamb. In the middle of its street and on either side of the river was the tree of life, which bore 12 fruits, each tree yielding its fruit every month. The leaves of the tree were for the healing of the nations. At the age of 18, Bob DeAndre was caught up into heaven and shown this very river flowing from God's throne and the trees on each side with their fruit and leaves. Today we pay tribute to this man who had a desire and vision to proclaim the gospel of the Lord Jesus Christ so that every man, woman, and child could go to this glorious place called heaven. Powerful, powerful. A memorial service and um, the celebration of a life lived for the Lord. I don't know, Jim, I know we're about out of time. So could you go back to the two screens uh, that have the hours uh, that we're going to air the service and then where they can send donations? Um, I know that's not on the script. Uh, <laughs> I'm going off script, but I, wanna, I wanted to share that with you again so you can... Uh, Know the hours, write that down so you can watch this service. I know you will be blessed. And again, WTJR here in Quincy, we will air the memorial service for Robert Bob DeAndrea on Monday, February 28th at 2 a.m., Sunday, March 6th at 9 p.m., Sunday, March 13th, 11 a.m., and Saturday, March 26th at 8 p.m. If you would like to send cards or a memorial donation, you can send them to Christian Television Network, Post Office Box 6922, Clearwater, Florida, 33758. And, uh, you know, Bob, Mr. DeAndrea was all about souls. That was his heart cry, was to reach the world with the gospel of Jesus Christ. And I'm so thankful here at WTJR, we got to be a part and still are a part of the CTN family. That still is our mission, to reach the lost, to reach this world with the good news, the gospel of Jesus Christ. I pray you know Jesus today as your Lord and Savior. And if not, just take time to say, God, I need you to come in and forgive my sins and walk with me each day. God bless you. We'll see you next week.